today I am down at a traditional Boxing Day race where the runners in Colchester race against the local cyclists over around a six, seven kilometer um, cross country course. This is a really historic event that's been happening in Colchester since the 1930s. Um, and ever since 1948, it's been held on Boxing Day, traditionally the day after Christmas here in the UK. The cyclists and runners are all competing for a cup called the Markham Cup. Um, where basically the top six runners versus the top six cyclists compete to win this historic cup. Last year I came uh, fifth place, first runner, um, but fifth overall. Um, so four cyclists were ahead of me and the guy who, who ended up winning it called Cam was um, done it in about 18 minutes and I finished the course in about 22 minutes, so five minutes behind the lead cyclist. So this morning, I'm gonna try and get a little bit closer to uh, the cyclists and see if the runners can win it this year. But for the last 19 years, um, the cyclists have won it. But I've heard this year, there's a few more log jumps um, and areas where the cyclists have to dismount. So hopefully this year, it'll be a lot closer, um, but it's always a really, really fun event to do here, especially the day after Christmas day. And um, we've got all the family coming down this morning to watch. Um, and yeah, and hopefully it's a nice, fun, muddy event, just like it was last year. So the shoes of choice for today's race are these Innovate X Talons, I think they're called. Um, I picked these up on Facebook Marketplace, I think, for about five, or 10 quid, something like that. Um, I used them last year uh, on the course and they're really good. Nice amount of grip, good deep lugs there. Um, part of the course is on a, on a hill and it's sort of um, concrete, so you can't wear, or you could wear spikes, but it wouldn't be very comfortable. So I find um, trail shoes are the best um, choice for this race. So if you ever want to do the Boxing Day versus runners tradition here in Colchester, I'd recommend some trail shoes with some nice deep lugs on them like this. Like this. Like this. <laughs> So we're just walking down to get my number now, get it all pinned on. Um, this event takes place in Friday Woods in Colchester, which are uh, where the army train? Is yeah, that right? so in Colchester we have a lot of army, like, well, base, I guess. Yeah. And um, the army train here, we should go. Some of it is man made. Yeah, so a lot of the, the course is where the army trucks and um, tank type vehicles will drive through so it's all like churned up and rutted which make it quite interesting running conditions um, very, especially for cycling fun to watch. it is a really fun one to watch last year like there was a hill and someone in, on a bike bless them, just went all the way back down the hill and fell yeah. into the river yeah i'm sure so that will happen today try and get as many people falling over as possible yeah. on camera if you can <laughs> So here's my vest, number 89. Now this is the actual vest that I wore last year. As you can see, it's been in my cupboard the whole year. Um, so I've started a tradition that I'm gonna wear the same vest every year um, and build on the mud from, from last year. Hopefully it brings me some luck. Come on, man. 
First lady. Woo woo! See again today. Cam Hurst. Woo woo! So there we go, that's the runners versus cyclists traditional Boxing Day race done for another year. Surprise, surprise, the cyclists won. I think it was the 20th or 21st time that they've won it in a row. So yeah, kudos to the cyclists. Um, I was fifth today, um, first runner and fifth overall. So yeah, exactly um, the position I finished last year. Hopefully next year I can get fitter and fitter and challenge the cyclists. Um, but yeah, always really fun to do that one. And thanks to Craig who organized the event and put out all of the logs and the course. Um, it was really good this year probably the best the best course unfortunately conditions were really dry so it, it meant that um, it was a lot easier for the cyclists this year so competition again I think Cam who ended up winning probably was about five minutes ahead of me today um, but yeah well done to Cam and all the cyclists and well done to all the fellow runners as well um, it's a really good one so if you're culture based definitely give it a go next year um, and look out for Craig's events on Facebook and but until next time aspire to run run to inspire enjoy the rest of your Christmas and we'll see you again soon